Hey guys, what's happening? Rev and Evan here at Bowling Green, Kentucky at the NMRA World Finals. Hanging out with my man Justin Pixley, Mast Motorsports, and they've got some awesome Godzilla stuff. Justin, what do you guys have cooking at Mast for Godzilla? Uh, we've got a lot of things going on right now we're pretty excited about. Uh, this is our turnkey engine package. This is more of our street combination. Uh, it's turnkey, ready to go from intake to oil pan. Uh, this combination, it runs on 93, you know, pump gas, so uh, it made 675 at 6400, I believe, and 610 foot-pounds at uh, 5000, so it's a, it's a stump puller for sure, it's, uh, we're pretty excited. So. so 675 horsepower, I see some of the parts you got over there, so this is not exactly a, uh, a stock Godzilla. What exactly have you done so far? Uh, so far we've got a few different options for camshafts. Uh, we've got our camshaft. We also did a uh, VVT delete. Uh, we uh, blocked the cam out. It's actually an adjustable gear, so you're able to advance, retard. You can get your cam degreed where, where you like it, get it, get it where you need to. Uh, we also um, have done, we have a factory uh, program for the uh, a port for the factory cylinder head uh, so we offer a CNC porting service uh, we do that in, in our control package that we kind of put together and it's uh, we're, we're pretty excited about it so far and kind of taking pretty big strides I feel for as new as the combination is and got a lot of research to do and a lot of a lot more testing but we've got some pretty cool pretty cool parts coming down the pipe that'll uh, really, I think, benefit us in the, in the end. So, got an intake manifold, hopefully, that uh, oh, nice. we'll, be, we'll be working on. But that, that'll be later on down the road. So we're just, this is really our debut in the, in the Ford stuff. You know, we're known for, been known in the LS world sure. as much as that. You know, I hate to say it Ford, but <laughs> I don't want to get hit in the head. But uh, no, uh, we're just hoping we can get our name out there and be known for the Ford stuff, uh, like everything else we do. And, we're just uh, excited to uh, do testing and uh, see see how far we can we can push this new combination. I think it's a solid platform. It's a good foundation to start with. So we'll have a supercharged combination that we'll uh, we'll be doing shortly, and it should be hitting the dyno and can give you some feedback on what we find with it. So right. Um, so not just uh, talking the talk. Obviously they're walking the walk, but you're building a '66 Mustang with a Godzilla under the hood which is here we'll get a look at that in a minute we'll get a look at the cylinder head that you guys have done right yes, but sir. first can we hear this thing run yes sir Sounds incredible. That's probably one of the best sounding uh, Godzillas we've heard so far. Of course, it's got a set of dyno headers on it, but it's got that nice cackle to it. Right. Yeah, it's got a deep tone. Everybody keeps coming up and they're like, is it a big block? Is it a small block? And it's uh, got a lot of some confusion, but uh, right. I think uh, pretty soon everybody will know, know about the Godzilla. So. so this is the mast cylinder head right here. And you can see there's a bunch of CNC work. I'll let uh, Justin take you through the head from, let's start with the intake ports. Yeah, we've uh, pretty much, this is our, um, this is our port that we developed um, for the stock, stock casting. Um, it's really just a, we'll go through, do some cleaning up in areas and uh, it's still, still the stock, uh, stock valve size right now. We'll go through, run intake exhaust. It's fully ported. Uh, from intake, exhaust, and chamber. Um, what do you got going on with the chamber? So you see some CNC work. What advantages are you seeing by doing the machine work? Well, we've uh, we found just um, removing some material in certain areas. We found that uh, we picked up picked up mainly, I think, around in the bowl area in the in okay. the chamber work. So right. I got um, is where the where the biggest biggest gains have been. So. Uh, I think at 700, it's uh, three, 355, I believe, is what it's what it's okay, moving. So it's, uh, yes, sir. Cool. And it's, then on uh, exhaust, 
see you got some CNC port work going on in the exhaust. You can get in there, Abe. And got Abe on the camera today here in Bowling Green. Just picking up flow, right? Short term radius stuff, typical stuff. Yes, sir. Um, what else do you got? So we got some parts on the table here. The camshaft, you got some uh, header plates. So if you want to build your own headers and you're doing a swap like we are in our cyclone, this mounts to the cylinder head. And then you can make your own headers that come off of here if you don't want to use the stock manifolds. Yeah, this is, uh, this is pretty much our rod and piston combination. It's a Wiseco piston, um, you know, big, beefy, uh, beefy around the top, uh, good for supercharged power adder combinations, as I'm sure we'll see a lot of that uh, here pretty soon. Um, a lot of people are going to be wanting to throw, throw boost. I've seen some turbo combinations and supercharged combinations already. and. Had a few uh, guys interested in maybe possibly building some nitrous combinations. So we've got a few other swap parts. Well, uh, as far as universal motor mounts, uh, our header flanges. Um, we're also going to be doing our fuel rail. Uh, this is just a prototype rail right now. Okay. Um, the camshaft. We've done uh, our VVT delete um, just for really the ease of controlling. We'll lock the cam out, it's an adjustable gear, so uh, you're able to degree it, put the cam where you where you want it, and lock it down solid and let it rip. This is our spring package. Uh, I believe it's a 2100 installed height. Uh, I believe it's 155 on the seat. Uh, it's good for 650 lift. Um, it's spent a little time developing it, and so far it's uh, it's worked out for us, so we're uh, we're happy to see see what else we can do with it. This is just kind of the beginning stages of it, and we'll um, continue to test and develop and make make it better. I also see you got so you got an engine that we'll look at. We'll show you in a second um, with a supercharger on it on display here. Tell us a little bit about that. Uh, the supercharged engine. It's a, it's a 2650 uh, hair up. Uh, that engine is going to. It's actually going to be a customer engine. It'll be built. It'll get our connecting rod and piston combination, and uh, that'll be a little, little rowdier of a combo. We're hopefully shooting for around 1,200 range, uh, 1,200 horse range, and uh, still got a lot of testing to do with it. But uh, that's some of the more fun stuff I'm looking forward to is the power adder stuff. So, so lastly, tell me about the. Uh 66 Mustang, it's pretty cool. Uh, it's uh, it's my 66 coupe. Um, the car originally had a uh, 460 based combination, it had a 501 and a power glide. And run it for a while, I've had it for about two years and kind of messed with it. Well, uh, we started getting into the Godzilla platforms and decided to uh, be a cool, cool opportunity to uh, have a shop test car to an R&D car pretty much to come out and display what we can do and display our parts and kind of kind of show what we can do in the Ford world so way better than having an LS in there right right <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm excited I've been the, the lone Ford guy at the shop for for years so it's finally uh, finally my time I guess <laughs> that's great we're, we're all excited even though a uh, bunch of uh, LS guys but I think if it's Loud, rowdy, and fast. Everybody, uh, it's all cool. good car stuff. It's all tall car guy stuff. So, so Justin, where do we find you on the internet? Where are you guys located? And uh, if somebody wants to get a hold of you, how do they do that? Uh, we're uh, our company's Mass Motorsports. We're located out of Nacogdoches, Texas, little town in East Texas. Uh, we've got um, all the social media. We have Instagram, Facebook. Uh, we have our website, MassMotorsports.com. Uh, if there's anything that I may have missed today, we've got all of this information on the website. Uh, just click the drop down menu and you'll go to factory mass and you'll find it under the, the Godzilla section. So. A lot of stuff as far as uh, dimensions on the engines for the guys that are interested in the swaps, right. comparing it Coyote to small block. We've got some of that, um, but yeah, we've also got some cool parts and pieces that we may not have here today, so um, get a chance. That's uh, that's where you can you can find us so cool man well thanks everybody for checking out the Rev and Evan YouTube channel be sure to subscribe hit that like button leave a comment and uh, we're gonna keep this thing rolling thanks a lot man thank you appreciate it